In this example, we're going to factor the binomial expression x squared plus 16 using our sum of squares factorization. So remember that sum of squares is a lot like difference of squares, except of course we have an addition instead of a subtraction, and also we have imaginary numbers in our factorization. So let's go ahead and factor it, and we'll multiply it back together just to make sure. So x squared plus 16, I need the square root of both terms. So I'll put those in parentheses. So the square root of x squared is x. And then my formula, that'll be my a. And then the square root of 16 will be 4. And for my formula, that'll be b. And of course, the formula also tells us we need 1 to be plus and 1 to be minus. It doesn't matter which one you choose. And then the B term needs to be imaginary. So we're going to have quantity x plus 4i times quantity x minus 4i. Let's go ahead and multiply that back out and see how this works. So x times x is x squared. And then x times negative 4i will be minus 4ix. And then a positive 4i times x will be a plus 4ix. And then the positive 4i times the negative 4i is going to give us negative 16i squared. Okay, well the i squared we know is actually negative 1. So it'll make this negative 16 become a positive 16. And again, right away too, we see that these middle terms actually cancel each other out. And we're left with x squared plus 16, which was our original problem. So we see that our sum of squares factorization worked well in this example.